welcome to French Fried Trains. Today, we're going to be doing something a little different here, and I'm going to be showing you how to make this standard American school bus here. And then, once we built it, I'll also show you how to modify it here into this flat-nosed version. Which is pretty much the same, just a different front end on it here. So let's get right into the build now. So we're going to start off with a block of coal on the side here. And a stone button on the side of it. Then three polished black stone slabs on the upper hip box like this. And another block of coal with a stone button on this side. Come behind it here. And we're going to make a line of polished black stone slabs on the upper hip box. And that's going to be 15 blocks long. And then we're going to fill this whole thing in with polished black stone slabs up here. Five wide all the way down to the back of this section. Then behind this, we're gonna do a block of coal on each side again, and three slabs in the center, and then a stone button on each outside edge. Next, we'll come up by these wheels, and we're gonna put a temporary block here in here and same thing for these back wheels come back to whichever end your front's going to be we're going to put an upside down outward facing oak stair above the wheel on each side then come forward with another temporary block on each side do an upside down backward facing oak stair on either side then we can take out all these temporary blocks up here then up here we're going to do three polished black stone slabs on the middle and then a row of five across the front. Then on either side of the front up here, we're gonna put a yellow concrete. Then in the center, two rows of three coal blocks. And then we'll close acacia trap doors on all of the front of the coal here. Then we'll swing around behind this and on the front two blocks on each side, a right side up outward facing oak stairs, two of them on the front of each side like this. Then three yellow concrete across this top middle. Next, we're gonna put a temporary block on the side of this yellow concrete and put an angled wither skeleton skull on it. Take out the temporary block and put a lever underneath it going up into it. We're gonna do the same thing here. So temporary block, wither skeleton skull, take out the temporary block and a lever underneath it here. Then on either side of the front, we're going to put a glow item frame with glowstone. Now we'll cover the top of this nose with yellow carpet up here. Then swing around behind here on top of each side, we're going to do a black concrete above the stair on each side here. Then across here, we're going to do two cyan stained glass, yellow concrete, two stained glass. Then we'll swing around behind this and on the bottom of each side, we're gonna do a full line of yellow concrete coming back and stop right before this back wheel. We'll do the same thing over here. Then we actually need to use a door and the doors have windows so the driver can see. So for that I'm going to use an acacia door. We're going to take out this front block on this side and put a door right here. Then we're going to switch over and we're going to take out black concrete and we're going to do a full row of black concrete above the yellow, stopping before this back wheel. Same thing on this side here. Then we'll take out stained glass panes and behind the front windshield on each side, we're going to do two stained glass panes coming back. So two here and two here. Now we'll come to these back wheels and right above them, we're going to put an upside down forward facing oak stair above each wheel. Then take out these temporary blocks 
then actually in front of the wheel here, we're gonna take out the slab and the yellow concrete, and we're gonna put an upside down outward facing oak stair in that gap. Same thing here, take out these two, upside down stair. Then behind these back wheels, we're gonna do a five by three of polished black stone slabs coming back. Then we'll do a row of yellow concrete on each side, and then a row of black concrete on each side. Then on this bottom middle, three yellow concrete. Then we're gonna do black concrete on either side with a door in the center. Then on either side of the door, cyan stained glass, and then yellow concrete on each outside edge. Up here, an outward facing polished black stone stair on either side, and three polished black stone blocks across the top middle. Come above the windshield, do the same thing. So a polished black stone stair on either side, and three polished black stone on this top middle here. Then we'll put two glow item frames on either side of the top up here. And same thing back here, two glow item frames on either side. On the bottom back here, a warp sign in the center, and then two dark oak signs on either side of it. Then come around the corner, and a dark oak sign here, and one on this side. Then on the yellow concrete layer on bottom, we're gonna put a glow item frame on either side with a redstone block in it. Then redstone blocks on either side of the top and blocks of gold on the inner ones. Then redstone torches on either side of the black and above it, crimson buttons. Then on this bottom corner down here, an acacia button and one down here on this side. Then we can come up front here. We'll put a redstone block on either of these outer item frames and a gold block on the inner ones. Then we'll come down here, a warp sign on the bottom center, two dark oak signs on either side of it. Then come around the corner, one dark oak sign here, one on this side here. Then on this top middle here, we're going to put a birch sign and type the word school bus. Then we're going to hit that with black dye and a glowing sack. We're going to do the same thing at the back. So come back here in the middle, a birch sign with school bus. Hit it with black dye and a glowing sack. And here I realized I had the wrong color stained glass panes up here. So I switched them out for the correct colors to match the windshield. Then behind this, right behind the stained glass, we're going to put a block of yellow concrete, every other block coming down to the back. Then we'll do the same thing on this side, yellow concrete, every other block. Then we'll fill all these gaps with cyan stained glass panes for all the windows same thing on this side here. Then we'll come over on this side. Right here, knock out this black concrete, put in redstone. That's for the little stop sign. If you want it folded out, put a piece of red stained glass sticking out. Now come up on the side here, right here, put a lever and a white stained glass pane for another mirror above it. Do the same thing on this side, white stained glass pane and a lever. Then we're gonna come up top and fill the whole top middle three up here, end to end, with smooth quartz blocks. Then once that's done on the outside edge, we're gonna do a full row of outward facing smooth quartz stairs up here, end to end. And of course, we'll do the same thing on this side here. Then on top, just in front of where the back wheel is, two iron trap doors here. Then aligned with this second window on the side, two iron trap doors up there. Now we're gonna come on and do the inside here. So come on in through this door. Over here, in the center under the window, two rows of three, netherite. Then over here on bottom, two netherite coming back. Then 
one on the opposite side with the middle open. Then, right behind that, we're going to fill the whole floor in, three wide end to end here with netherite. Then we'll come back up front and we're going to grab a polished deep slate stair. We're going to put this stair in the center here, then aligned with that redstone block on each side we're going to do a column of two nether brick fences. Then right here a dark oak stair for the driver's seat. Right here open a fence gate then a lever and a stone button. Then we'll come all the way to the back and we'll start putting stairs on either side every other block for all the seats. Just like that. Now we have a full interior for our school bus here. And this completes the base build for the school bus. Now I'm going to show you how to modify this into the flat nose version here. So we're going to come down here above this front wheel and we're going to swap out this oak stair for yellow concrete. We'll do the same thing on this side and then everything in front of that front tire we're going to erase all of this just take it all off and just keep it coming here deleting all this So we should have something that looks like this. Then we're also going to take off each of these front tires here and replace it with a polished black stone slab on either side here. Then we're going to come to this other side behind the door here and we're going to take off these two yellow concrete and the two slabs under it. We're going to put an outward facing upside down oak stair and a backward facing one. At the back of this gap, a block of coal with a button so we've moved the wheel back. We have to do the same thing on this side, so take out these two and the two slabs under it. Outward facing upside down stair, forward facing, then a block of coal with a button. And now we've replaced the front wheels here and we'll work on the front end. We're going to do a glow item frame with glowstone on the bottom of each side and then a skeleton skull above it on each side. Then on this bottom middle, we're going to do a warp sign and two dark oak signs on either side of it. Come around the corner and a dark oak sign here and also around the corner on this side here. Then we're going to close two rows of acacia trap doors across the front middle for the front grill. And that completes the modifications here to the flat nose version of our school bus. Now you can also play around with the colors here. I'll show you a different one I built in my world real quick. So on this one here, you can see I've changed the trap doors on the front to look like an older style of grill. And we've changed all of the yellow concrete to yellow concrete powder to give it an old and faded look. And I'll also have a different color version here. So you can play around with it, play around with the colors, and get the bus how you want it looking. So that completes our tutorial. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And everyone have a great week. Stay safe out there.